Alright, so welcome back to Palia. We're here playing back at our little base because we have a bunch of quests that we can do. We picked up a bunch of quests last time and now I just want to kind of um, go through. Let's see. News. Oh, they sent some gifts over. Oh, I'm out of inventory space. Okay. Eat. I need a couple spaces though. What's this? Grilled mushrooms? Okay, I could eat those too. There we go. Now I got a couple spaces. Okay. Honey lure and sticky smoke bombs. Okay, so now it wants me to place a table, a chair, and a wardrobe. Um, do I have those things? Or, um, kind of forgetting how to do things here. Let's do spiffy it up. Let's toggle what the quest is shown in the HUD tracker. Go to your workbench and select a recipe to craft furniture. Okay, that's right. So my workbench here. So you need to make a chair, a table. And what else was there? A wardrobe. So that's 50, 95 wood. I need 95 wood. Breaking stuff up a lot. Like, and I'm sure I can go out past my fence and break some of the bigger trees for more wood, but like. Let's clear out inside our thing for a while. And hey, we're going to be gaining some uh, wood cutting levels probably. Sorry, you need to upgrade your tool. Okay, so it's not... My tool isn't good enough to break down big trees anyway. Eight sapwood. What are we at? 45 so far? is now level 2. Does that mean I do more damage to like trees and stuff? I don't think so. Nine. Chopped, looted 30 trees, 79. I'm almost there. I need 11 more wood. That gave me zero. Eight. One, two more. None. Four. Okay. Should be enough to make all things. Make.
what should I learn to make? Uh, let's make a learn how to make a bed. Okay, offering bounty. Looks like your inventory is full. Understood. Let's put some stuff away. Um, don't need that. Milk. Don't need the sticky smoke bombs. Friends will turn green. I can place that somewhere. Um, keep those. Pallium bar. Don't need those right now. That'll take large. Dropping your keys around this vent is not advised unless you have a lot of spares lying around. Okay. Place on the ground lowers more insects for a short period of time. Stone, flint, plant fiber. That's something I can place too. No. Here. Let's go place some of this stuff. Like, how do I place the? Oh, he's big. Oh. You don't own. You don't own this land yet. Something is in the way. Cancel. Hold on. There we go. Now I can place him. He is huge. And then we just got this little kitty rug that we can put in the middle of our tent there. Alright, cool. So I made a chair. Chair's done. Let's make a dining table. Okay. What should I learn to make? Um, this one. Log cabinet. Wall cabinet. Okay. So I guess as you make stuff... Oh, I'm three short. I guess I miscounted. There we go. Oh, that's plenty. Torch. Cool. Gonna light it up out here a little bit after I place everything. Put the table there. Where's our chair? We're gonna... I like how it snap rotates. This chair there. We need our little uh, wardrobe. Right. There. Yeah, we can like change our clothes and all that kind of stuff. Cool. Talk to Kenley at your plot. I don't see Kenley, so maybe I just gotta wait for her to get here. The next thing we can do is we can craft a campfire, which we use to cook, and cooking is always good in games like this. So let's put that out here somewhere, just kind of in the middle of everything. Forage three mushrooms. Any kind? Yeah, I guess. These are counting. So it's kind of like 3D Stardew Valley. A little bit. Cook the mushrooms. Got the grilled mushrooms. Eat the grilled mushrooms to gain focus. How do I? 
I gain 50 focus. Use 50 focus. How do I do that? You can gain bonus XP for doing any skill. Use 50 focus. Do I use the focus just by doing things? Yep, I guess so. I guess when I run out of focus, I can just go get more food and make more food. There's a couple of trees that I don't even have the tools to break them. my tools. And I don't know how to do that. Do I do that at a workbench? Did I make my tools at a workbench? Pretty sure I did. There. It seems to be pretty much all cleared out. Bet you this won't. Nope. Need to have a better tool. Can I do that? Crafters. Miscellaneous. Yep, can't really make tools. What's up, Badger? Good to see you again, Spring Bean. This place is really starting to look different. I figured you'd still be working on setting up that tent. That's some work ethic. Work ethic's my middle name. I can tell. The magistrate's gonna like you. Once she gets to know you, that is. She's a tad bit prickly with new folks. May have been working up an appetite from all that chopping and mining. Well, if you've got patience, I've got a solution for your woes. Gardening. All you have to do is wait a few sun cycles and voila, dinner. Or breakfast, even lunch, if the mood strikes you. I know, I know, it doesn't sound exciting, but trust me, nothing tastes better than a carrot you've grown yourself. Got all the tools you need right here. To go on, why don't you drop this plot down and give it a good till? Okay. Oh, I see you're hailing it a day for now. <laughs> okay. So now we can farm stuff that we can cook. So we gotta put a couple plots down. Three. Yep, and it does attach. Cool. And then he gave us... Oh wow, that's like... Kinda specific. In the coolest way possible. Yeah, and see now that plot's ready. So you gotta... There's definitely, like, an efficiency element to this. Yeah. This is interesting. And I think it's using focus, so that helps my other quest too. Okay. 
Alright, so all those plots are ready. And then... Oh, that's an insect thing. Okay. Don't need that, then. So, wait. I need to see what my... Gardening 101. Till the soil with your hoe. Return to our bedroom. Might be wondering what to do next. Fortunately, seeds don't plant seeds don't plant water themselves. You're gonna need some of these bad boys. Consider it a housewarming gift. Once your seeds are in the ground, go to that pond and fill up this here watering can and give that dirt a nice little bath. It might take a few sun cycles and a few buckets of water, but trust me, it'll be worth the wait. Some things you plant might have an effect on the seeds around it. For example, carrots and onions keep weeds from growing next to them. If you find yourself needing more seeds, you can pick them up at Zeki's. I can't wait to see you again, neighbor. That would have been funnier if I'd given you wheat seeds. Hmm, I gotta work on my material. Okay. Let us make this day a great one. I love that character. He's so cool. Alright, so we're gonna plant some... Carrots. And some onions. And then I gotta go get some... Oh, he gave me a watering can. Okay. Refill water cans from the nearby pool. Simply equip your watering can and plus right-click near a valid source of water. So hold R and slip on. Crops will never wither progress. It's only paused until they are watered. Okay. Oh, there's a pond right outside my thing. Why am I trying to go all the way out here? Yeah. Then I can just... So as long as they stay watered, then they will stay, they will stay growing. Okay, let's talk to Kenley. Wonderful news. I found the forms under the bookshelf in the records room. They're only a little crumpled too. You can just sign here and I'll be able to get you that blueprint. Sign. Yes, here too and here. There we have it. And I even remembered how to bring blueprint. Remember to bring the blueprints with me. These are now yours. So just you plop the frame down as soon as possible and get building. Now if you'll excuse me, I do believe it's time for my break. Okay. I'm too famished to keep talking. Okay. Place the foundation for your house. Okay. Um How do I do that? Do I build it? Access the advanced housing menu while on your plot and place the blueprint. Is it? Building limit. Oh. Oh. house Let me 
a second. No, I don't. I'm not trying to. Man, everything's in the way right now. So I gotta, like, move stuff around. Okay. Mainly the campfire here. There we go. Cool. Okay. Add resources to your building to complete construction. Well, what is it? Well, what does it need? How do I know? It just says finish building your house. Oh, upgrade? Oh, sapwood plank and stone brick. How do I... Because I have sapwood. Just sapwood. Um... You can't really make any of that here. What do you need? Oh good, you're still here. Kenley mentioned you found the blueprints for your house, so I thought I'd stop by to give you some other helpful tips. If you want to finish your house, you'll need to get stone bricks and sapwood planks. Okay, that's what I was just looking for. Um, so get comfortable with wood cutting and mining. You met your innkeeper, Ashura, right? He can teach you how to make a sawmill for those planks. And Hundari sells the stone smelter you'll need for bricks. If he's not in the village, check Bahari Bay to the east. That's where he lives. So happy to hear you decided to make Kilima your home. I have to stop by again with some housewarming gifts. Cool. So I have foraging level 2, but I have to get mining level 2. I'm probably just wandering around and hitting stuff. Yeah, I'm close though. Two more. There we go. Mining is now level two. What other quests do I have? Because I know I have the... This one I just have to wait to harvest. Collect common blue butterfly. Collect Kilima night moth. Okay. Hunt a chop a hop a certain... Still working on using focus. Okay. Yeah. All right, let's go to town. I want to get the stuff to make the sawmill and the and the other place. I'm gonna need to expand soon. I'm running out of room. That's fine. I can go 200 meters. So he is inside. Yeah, here he is. How can I help? 
You know, starting at a new place can be tough, but you've been doing a great job. I thought I'd help you out. I've got a couple of recipes for purchase that might make your life a little easier. Probably want to get a sawmill first thing to turn some of that wood into planks. Don't cut any fingers off, okay? Recipe basic sawmill. I don't have any... I don't have any coins. Um, okay. I'll see you around. G is open store. Okay. Yeah, I need to get coins. How do I get coins? break wood out here okay and then I'm guessing it like comes back and you know I bet I can sell crops but I have to wait full sun cycles for crops to grow I can sell sapwood. Just said something about something to the east. From Hodari. Oh, because he lives at Bahari Bay. Okay. I guess I can sell him a bunch of wood. Maybe. Wrong house. Oh, I need to go across the... Across the bridge. sleep
darn. Yeah, essentially I gotta start selling stuff. What you up to? Hello. Let's talk tomorrow. I can't really do any of my other quests until I get these ones done. Maybe I wait for the other guy to come out. Maybe I just go find him. Caught a bug. Oh, I could catch and sell bugs. And maybe, like, pick stuff up and... Okay. Oh, there's a blue, blue butterfly. Which was one of my quest things. Oh, come on. Catch it. Caught a star quality item. Okay. Oh, kind of like Stardew Valley. Okay. And then... It was like one of the moths or something? Oh, you can catch one or the other. And then talk to Aoni. I just saw him. And then maybe I can sell them? There he is. It's like I know he's right here somewhere. Are you off on an adventure? Howdy. I caught some bugs. Great job. I wish I had some kind of reward for you. Uh, how about this? Mom picked me picked lunch and I couldn't finish. Hmm? That's not really a reward, huh? Oh yeah. Yeah, so just check your mail later. But real reward is fun. You had learning catching bugs, am I right? Okay. Was that a dragonfly? No. Okay. So maybe if I do some hunting now. Because catching bugs... I could probably make a huge profit. Wait, what? What? And a bunch of stuff. Trying to... Trying to get some money. So I guess this is like a regular smoke bomb. But then in my mail, I got like a better smoke bomb. I think the lure is done. Alright, but I caught, like, a ton of stuff. The only question now is who do I sell it to? I also have stuff that'll probably raise my focus. Um, yeah, I did get a milk. Okay. 
Are you awake yet? while he's sleeping. Okay. Can I get in from the balcony? I just <laughs> jump over? That'd be funny. So it's like 8.02 a.m. What time does stuff open? Let's ask. What time does stuff open? Breath. What does she need? sell here. Yeah, see, these are worth a lot. Like, I've caught a bunch of stuff, so if I can just find out where where to sell this stuff, I'll be golden. I, I totally wasn't sleeping. What can I do you for? Grilled some mushrooms. Nice work. A bit more practice and you'll be making your own soup soon enough. But hey, I wouldn't mind if you keep stopping by for mine. In fact, here's some free samples on the house. Sweet! Well, I could use some extra focus. Let's eat. 100 focus. That's good. really want to access the shop. Where do I sell bugs? That's like a blacksmith. He's not going to sell me bugs. Though he may have the tool upgrades. Oh, it says repair tools. Fully repaired, fully repaired. Okay, so the ba basic ones are just... Okay, we're learning. We're learning. City Hall. Blacksmith Repair Station. Central Stables. Tavern. Taylor, general store. Oh, general store. So it's the one in the middle over here. Hello. Yes. Okay. Sell the stack. Sell an item because there's only one. So the general store will pretty much buy anything. Gardenia flower. Sure. So now we have over 200 gold. To go buy things. Cool. It's very, like, Animal Crossing. God, what are the hours here? Go upstairs and bang on his door. Wake up. Oh, hi, Ashura. Here we go. I will purchase this. Recipe. 
sawmill and planks. Okay. So now I gotta go get the recipe for that from Hudari. I keep seeing people with gliders. Tish. Tau. Kenny. Aoni. Padru. Yeah, he must still be at the Shari Bay. Let's drop a waypoint over there just so I can head in the correct direction. Yeah, I keep seeing people with gliders, so I guess eventually we'll probably get one of those too. I've also seen people on like animals. Maybe we get mounts. That would be awesome. But yeah, catching bugs and or catching fish. Probably going to be my favorite ways of getting money when I need money. Oh, and this is where we can hunt stuff too. Right? Yeah, okay. No? Dang it. Alright, hold on. Can I... No. C does not do what I want it to do. Um... I so accidentally unequipped the bow. Dang it. Am I just missing? Oh, I got it. Okay. I got a Sir Nook. Nope, I missed. Okay. This is... Oh, there's Hodari. You need something? Heard you put that pick I gave you to work. If you want to hone those skills, build yourself a smelter. First step, turn rocks into bricks. I've got a couple of other recipes in stock that'll help you too. Check them out. Alright, so I buy the smelter. Cool. And then I can... Oh, I have to buy recipes from people. Okay. Hmm. Cool. Alright, so now I can build a smelter. Are you, are you gonna... It's not doing the thing. There we go. So I think you just have to hit him multiple times. Because see, I hit it and it starts running. And then it'll stop running eventually as long as I don't get too close to it. Oh, it ran all the way back there. But then if I follow it and hit it again, it'll go down. There we go. Nice. Okay. So did that complete my hunting 101? Oh, return to Hussein. Okay. See, we're getting stuff done. We're learning how the game works a little bit. It's very, um, like Animal Crossing, but RPG-esque. So I don't need to follow that little marker anymore. Um, I need to go to Hussein.
There he is. Oh, that's Tau. No, I don't want to play with Tau. Alright. Cool. I don't have time for this. Why have you returned? Did you think I would praise you for a job well done? It is every pal Pallian's duty to help maintain the balance of nature. In the interest of perpetuating that balance, I am obligated to give you this. Cernuk has been a traditional source of meat for generations in Kalima. But the Chapas, they're not natural to this environment. They overpopulate and destroy natural wildlife and vegetation. If you truly want to help our community, you will help eradicate this threat. It is only right that you humans do before you begin to run wild. To... Okay. They leave me alone now. I'm sure any further contact will conduct it over mail. Okay. All right. Try not to cause any trouble. Okay. I do have mail, it seems like. Right? News. Um. Yeah, and you can have, like, relationships. Yeah, so, like, it tells you who you've talked to that day. And if you talk to them every day, you can increase your level of friendship with them. To so unlock quests and get their keys to their houses and stuff. That's, that's pretty interesting. Alright, let's go back to our house, I think. How do I go there? You are here, Marker. Housing plot. Oh. Yeah, let's go back home. We want to build that sawmill and the smelter. Cook some of this food to get some focus to keep using focus Here. Good thing you're here. You won't believe what Najuma just told me. Um, no, she said that's top secret, but she told me something else, something really, really cool. She said a bug got stuck in her workshop chimney, so she let it go, and then it dropped a sprout, and she then she planted it, and it turned into a whole flower. Isn't that awesome? That's amazing. Obviously, I want to see that awesomeness for myself. Najuma said it was a common blue butterfly, and the sprout turned into a gardenia, but... She said, not every bug drops something, so I have to get a lot of them. It's not my fault. Butterflies are just so dang hard to catch. So I'm personally tasking every member of the Kalima Bug Scout with participating in this super important mission. That means you too. Yeah, let's do it. Catch as many butterflies as you can and see if they're dropping gardenia sprouts. We can do it. Okay. Gotta grab a snack. Okay, bye. So where do I make this? Do I make this here? Okay, yeah. Can make the sawmill. What about the smelter? Oh, I need Cernuk hide. Okay. Well, I'm gonna build and place that stuff in the next one. So thanks everybody for watching, and I will see you in the next one.